wondering how to wear a bunir. Learn more about how to wear small flowers on your lapel for special occasions. A bunir is a small flower, typically worn on the lapel of a suit or coat. While they are often associated with formal occasions like your wedding day, bunirs can be worn for any event where you want to add a touch of sophistication. The most important thing to remember when wearing a bunir is to keep it simple. A small bud or bloom is all you need to make a statement. Bunir comes from the French word for buttonhole. In the 18th century, it was fashionable for men to wear flowers in their buttonholes. While the tradition has since fallen out of fashion, the term boutonniere has remained. When choosing a flower for your boutonniere, it's important to pick a bloom that will complement your outfit. A good rule of thumb is to match the event's formality with the flower's formality. For example, less formal occasions like backyard barbecues would warn a more casual filler like baby's breath, while a black tie affair would call for a more formal filler like ivy or fern. The boutonniere stem should be fastened to the left side of your jacket, right above your heart. Make sure the boutonniere is not too high or too low on your lapel for the best look. Traditionally, boutonnieres are worn on the left lapel. This is because most people are right-handed, and it's easier to reach across your body to put on a boutonniere when you're getting dressed. Not all jackets have a buttonhole on the left lapel. If yours doesn't, you can still wear a boutonniere by attaching it to the left side of your jacket using a small pin. Just be sure to position the pin so it's not visible while wearing your jacket. Traditionally, a suit jacket will have a boutonniere latch or loop on the back of the lapel near the buttonhole to keep the flower upright. Otherwise, your flower may be permanently tilted without a boutonniere latch on the back of your lapel. If you're worried about your boutonniere drooping, you can do a few things to keep it upright. Start by cutting the stem of your flower at an angle. This will give the stem a larger surface area to grip the jacket fabric. Next, use a small piece of floral tape to secure the stem in place. Start by wrapping the tape around the stem just below the bloom, and then continue wrapping it down the stem until you reach the desired length. Finally, use a small wire to secure the bunir to your jacket lapel. Start by poking the wire through the back of the boutonniere and wrapping it around the front of the lapel. Be careful not to wrap the wire too tightly, as this could damage the fabric of your jacket. While a boutonniere is a great way to add style to your outfit, there are some occasions when it's appropriate to remove it. For example, if you're attending a funeral, you should remove your boutonniere during the service. Another time when you might remove your boutonniere is during a meal. If you're attending a formal dinner, Keeping your boutonniere on during the meal is considered rude. Instead, wait until you've finished eating to put it back on. Finally, fluff up your boutonniere and adjust it to sit upright. You're ready to take on the world, or at least that special event you're attending.